Hello and welcome to Red Gaming Tech for your daily dose of your latest gaming news and myself, Marta. Today is the 12th of December and I have some news for you regarding Battlefield 4 as a new game update has been released for the PlayStation 4 version of the game. And the patch was announced on the official Battlefield forum, which is of course the battle log, earlier today. Now, this update does aim to solve many of the client crash and audio drop issues that players have been reporting while playing the game. Now, they, I will go through the full patch notes, of course, but players may have to restart the game in order to install the update, so just a little bit of a caveat there. And the forum post did also assure that DICE is continuing to work on future updates based on user feedback. So if you don't see the issue that you personally have been suffering in this list, not to worry. I'm sure it's on DICE's list of things to fix for Battlefield 4 on PS4. So, the patch. We have general stability fix fixes that should remove a large amount of the client crashes that we are currently seeing on the PS4. Fix the audio dropouts that could occur when playing on large maps. Typical map affected was a Goldwood Railway in Conquest with 64 players. Ambient sound was sometimes cut out, like Foley sounds from player running, vehicle engine sounds, vehicle movement sounds, and map ambient sounds. Remove the blur effect on soldiers that appeared when commanders were using EMP attacks. Further reduce the probability of getting a corrupt save file by doing miscellaneous changes to the save file system. These include removing the save file, removing the save, saving again when quitting multiplayer. Fix multiple crashes that could occur when bringing up the in-game battle log during round transition. Fix the crash that could occur when using the battle screen. Fix the random crash related to destroying vehicles. Fix minor destruction issues in the terrain. So there you have it, a few pretty large issues that were dealt with there, mostly, as I said previously, stability focused and more just about improving the experience for those of you playing the game on PS4. Now I've said this many times, but Battlefield 4 seems to be a bit beleaguered at the moment um, with lots of bugs and issues happening, mostly on the next gen console versions, but even on PC there's been a few issues and even on the original uh, previous gen console versions that have been uh, their fair share of issues and I just really hope that DICE gets this sorted soon because while well, it's kind of bringing down the name of what is otherwise a safe but fun and beautiful looking game so no one wants to have their game that they're looking forward to for this time ruined or not ruined is a bit of a strong word but hampered somewhat by bugs and issues and all that so hopefully DICE get it fully sorted soon uh, it's a shame that they've been suffering so many issues. I guess this is one of the things that can happen when you're developing for multiple platforms at once. But I think DICE are handling it fairly well. They've been honest. They've apologised numerous times. They've even given EXP rewards to people suffering issues. And of course have been pretty handily handing out updates for each of the platforms as the days have gone by. So you kind of have to give them a little bit of credit for how they've been dealing with these issues. Anyway, that is me done for this video. Hope you've enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.